hello and welcome back to my channel once again so today oh first of all let me um ask about your welfare about your well-being so how are you guys doing out there i hope you all are doing well i hope you don't have any problem in any areas of your life and if you do um pray to god work hard i hope everything will be okay is there any of you that are um that is sick i wish you a quick and fast recovery so today i'll be um oh before i forget if you're new to my channel i really appreciate you uh, joining my uh, my little community i really appreciate thank you so much for joining uh, uh um coming into my channel and thank you so much for uh, those of you who are still uh, my subscribers who my faithful subscribers i thank you and if you like any of my videos you think that uh, uh, there's a particular video that you really appreciate that you really love what uh, i thought about please uh, in the video please feel free and share it let your friends get to know about my channel and thank you and god bless you as you do it so today i'll be talking about um how to understand men there are so many things that we really need to understand uh about men and their behaviors and uh, i think um it is good that we throw some light into those things there are so many it just i'm just going to be talking about just a little a little points from all those so many things about men what to, uh, you need to know in order to understand them because i believe that if we do know something about for men our lives will be you know better because um there are you know when you go out or when you go to any place at all in this world there is this 99.9 percent that you are going to meet a man there is it in your office is it in places of worship is it here uh, at schools at the universities at uh, uh, at your uh, at uh, recreation places at where you uh, at a restaurant at a hotel wherever it is there uh, you know there is no way you can avoid them and so and i'm thinking that you know if you really look uh take a look into their behavior into how they behave you know if you really take a look into all those things i think it will help us to really appreciate them and also understand that we although we are different there are men there are women we are all different but i think we are all working towards to uh the same goal we are all working to achieve the same <laughs> the same goals but from different perspective or from different direction so one thing you have to know about men is this you know if you really want to understand them one thing you have to know is this that men love to be manly you know they really want to you know to hover their manhood over anybody that is around them especially women so if you have a man at home or you have a boyfriend or you have a man friend or you are working in any office and you you see them around you and you happen to be a sort of a a, a superior over them maybe in the office don't don't take it too personal when you see them behaving uh, uh in a certain way that you don't like when you see them revolting against your your own principles you should accept it that men are really they are manly they like you know show you know this macho um um attribute that that are men that you can love them another thing is this one thing you have to know is this that men also they cry men do cry they do cry they do laugh they do have problems too and whenever they have problems and when if they could bring themselves down to you know bring themselves to 
telling you what is on their mind what is weighing them down why they are so angry or why they are so sad or why they are you know where where why they are emotionally moved because men for something to move a man emotionally then you know that that is very 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 serious they serious so if you find a man who is so emotionally moved and this man comes to you and tell you uh, his problems and pour out his heart to you please please my ladies don't you ever tell this man to stop crying to stop crying to be a man why are you crying are you a baby be a man men hate to hear that you should accept that they are also human beings like us if they want to cry please allow them to cry out their hearts by doing so they will feel good by doing so they have you know a sort of uh, um, uh, remove a burden that have been pulling them down weighing them down so allow them to cry out their heart to you if they want to don't tell them to stop crying or be a man they will they will not react immediately when you say please stop behaving like that be a man but believe you me when they have problem they will never come to you because you insulted them by telling them please be a man stop crying like a baby be a man although you although we normally say without um bad intentions but it's wrong to tell a man that another thing is this men love to be washed men love to be adored you know especially those of them that uh, that are in social network they will love their wives to pledge their loyalty and faithfulness to them on the social media hey this is my husband my all and all i love you this i love you that to the moon and back you know men love those kind of things that is men Another thing is this, um, men love to, you know, to, 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 how do I put it? <laughs> how do I put it? Okay, let me put it this way. If you have, um, two children and somebody ha happens to ask you how many children do you have? You know, if you're a woman and you say, and you, and you tell us this person that you have, four children instead of uh, three children or you have two children and you told this person that you have three children then I can understand you know men behave like kids sometimes you know so you should allow them to be that kids that they want to behave like uh, you know most times uh, that is just them and uh, they, they, they do it unintentionally so if you find your 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 husband or your man or your friend or your boyfriend or your colleagues in the office behaving like that sometimes please allow them to be the kid the kids that they are allow them to be the kid boys that they are you know they love all those things you know that is them please allow them just like we ladies we also behave like girls sometimes so allow them that is part of them that 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 you know when you want to know a man please no matter how big no matter how old the person is also behave like kids like children so men normally behave like kids sometimes another thing is this men uh some men or most men are not so romantic as we women would want them to be okay take for us uh, for instance if you're celebrating your birthday if you're celebrating your anniversary or if you're celebrating anything that has to go to the direction of love please don't waste your time leaving out traces or leaving out hits for your man to pick up if you if you're the type that keep on leaving our traces or keep on leaving our hits for him to pick up and not to know that he, uh, actually that he has to take you out to a dinner or he has to buy this for you that is your birthday or that is valentine day that you want him to take you out to a restaurant and you know a candlelight um dinner or something like that my dear if you are the type that you know leaving our traces or hits for him to pick up my dear 
you get, you grow old still waiting for him to take you out. If you want something, my dear, go straight. As far as you're dealing with a, a, a man, he's not a woman, please go straight. Tell him what you want. Tell him, okay, darling, um, so so and so day is our anniversary, our wedding anniversary. Or so so and so day is Valentine, uh, Valentine Day. I will want us to go to a restaurant. Simple, short, just go straight to point. Now, it is not left for him, to him to put into arrangement what, how or how he wants uh, uh, that day to, you know, uh, to how and where he will want to take you to and how he will want to do it and how he wants you to have a fulfill, you know, day on that particular day. So if you're the type that like leaving traces and leaving heat for your man to pick up, my dear, stop wasting your time. Just go straight to the point. Darling, tomorrow is Valentine's Day. I will want us to go to a restaurant and if you're also the type that is, you know, that like going to a particular re restaurant, please just tell him, look at where I want us to go and period. That is it. And another thing you want to know, uh, I would want you people to know is this, men, men are polygamous in nature. They might put a ring on your finger, you might be married to them. But then, one thing you have to remember is this, that, uh, you know, like in one of my videos, I say they have eyes, they make use of feet, and something like that. You know, they can, you can be sitting down with them and uh, a, a beautiful dancer, a beautiful lady will just pass by and he will just turn around and take a look at that person. And you know, don't feel so annoyed. It's just part of them, that polygamous in nature. But that doesn't mean that most of them, you know, uh, by looking at the person, uh, 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 he will jump at the person like a dog, no. Although, some people normally say all men are dogs, but not all of them anyway. There are some good ones out there. So, just knowing that men, they have, uh, they cheat. They normally have this cheating nature. It's just peculiar among all of them. And another thing you have to know is this that <laughs> this one is funny. That every man has a bit of donor thrown in him. So some men will want um some men will want uh, how do I put it? Some men will want, you know, to demonstrate this, you know, this strength of oh I am successful, I am great, I command respect. You know all this and that and that you know some men will really want to you know demonstrate that ego something like that so when you find yourself around any man who is doing that just ignore it that is peculiar to them and don't go fighting uh, them because whenever you stay down a fight you're going to go oh, oh, fall you will fail you will fail and fail okay. just leave them to their nature that is them that and again is this another thing is this men don't read minds let's assume you are sick and you are too and you didn't tell your husband that you are sick and that you can't carry on the normal house duty he will assume that maybe you're taking a, re a rest or maybe you are relaxing your son or from somewhere just coming you know it, they are not good at reading minds it, so anything you want just open your mouth go straight and tell them you know they are being logical that is that is their life that is part of them so um when you feel that um because you've been in, with him for so many years, you've been in a relationship with him for so many years, or you're married with him for so many years, that he should know that you're not feeling fine. Oh, you're wasting your time. They don't read minds. They are not good at reading minds. So if if there if there are at all some that practice that or that do that, then they are just a little, little percent of them. So that is it, and um, just remember that men understanding them and you know accepting them to be the way they are, you know, to 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 a sort of 
accept them the way they are and then um, you know try and put up with them i think it will make us really to live in peace with one another it will, it will help us also to manage one another and it will help us also to bring out the best from one another so that is it uh, don't just stress yourself out assuming that they know sometimes they don't they don't they don't they are just like us it's just that they are they they they, they form the habit of just hiding their emotions they hide it they hide it they bottle it up but they are also human beings like us we don't have so much difference when you you know try to compare a man and a woman so that is it for today and if you are just passing by and you and you think that i have something to offer subscribe 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 i want you to subscribe just hit the subscription uh, the subscribe button and you are in and anytime i upload a video you will be the you will just get an alert immediately just hit the subscribe button and there's a bell also uh, uh, around you see it also you hit the bell too and whenever i upload any video you just get the notification immediately thank you for watching god bless you and bye